Hello everyone, welcome back to Toby Chimp Plays The Park. In the last episode we went on the bumper cars and the ferris wheel and it was kind of... I don't know, there wasn't much going on really. It was a lot of exposition uh, about how Lorraine's a bad mother and her ex-partner died or something. Don. I don't really know. I wasn't listening. I was trying to concentrate on not getting spooked too hard. Anyway, time to move on towards what should be really the climax, I think, of this this series, which is both... I'm pleased about it and I'm sad about it at the same time. So anyway, I think we're going to go this way. If this map's correct, towards the roller coaster. Just called roller coaster. No fancy name or anything. Um, that's weird. Why is it like Tunnel of Tales, Octotron, uh, House of Horrors, Sideshow Alley, and then just Ferris Wheel, Bumper Cars, Roller Coaster. Anyway, let's get moving. How do I sprint? Can I sprint? Yes, I can sprint. I forgot about that in the last episode. I apologise. It has been a while since I played, so I couldn't work out how to actually run. So, not really sure what to expect around here. I should probably call out for Callum, shouldn't I? I've kind of forgot about that guy. Callum, where did you go? Callum. Uh, this is a tree. Is that a tree? There's also a Ferris wheel there, and also it's just auto saved, so I'm scared that something's going to happen. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> can I... Can I go this way? Can I jump? I don't want to go under here, because it's going to... It's a perfect time for it to freaking spook me. Oh... oh. Uh, no, I don't want to take that off it. Look at it. Look at this thing. Oh god. Don't spook me, please. Oh, I don't want to do it. Please. I pressed A and it didn't do it. <sighs> Alright, I'm only two minutes in I'm freaking out. Please. Take it. Whoa, no, 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 no. Uh, stop, please. Spin, spin, sugar is the achievement I just got. Well, thanks for taking out the tree anyway. I was worried about going underneath it, but now I can just walk through. Just, just run, Lorraine, please. Let's get this over with. Stop freaking out. You're okay. You're fine. Come to mommy, Callum. Come to, come to mommy, Callum. Please, trying to stay in the light. Aim for the light. We're fine. All right, let's get sprinting again. A lot again. of people oh idolize their children. You hear them talking about their kids and just the way they talk. Their fucking voices make me want to vomit. My angel likes to read, and little Johnny is so good on the piano. Fuck those people! You give up nine months of your life carrying them, you traumatize yourself giving birth to them, and then you spend the rest of your life as their slave. Wiping asses, mopping a piss, feeding them, little life-sucking monsters who take and take and take until... <sighs> we all go insane. Any parent who pretends otherwise is just dishonest. That's called choice supportive bias. I am honest. Callum really grinds my gears, and he owes me everything. Everything! It served the little fuck right if I just abandoned him. Wow. Okay, we're getting a little insight into how bad her parent Lorraine actually is. Starting to think that maybe. Not only is Callum dead, like, duh, maybe she killed him or something, or... She's definitely responsible anyway. How do I, how do I get into this place? I'm scared. This is going to be a scary one, I think. I'm not the biggest fan of roller coasters anyway, but... Abandoned, spooky roller coaster in the dark? Kind of kicks it up a notch, doesn't it? How do I get in? I have a ticket, don't I, so... I always wanted to ride this one. Oh, there we go. Never got around to do it before. Well, today's your lucky day, Lorraine, and thank you for choosing me to come with you. Really, really appreciate it. What was that noise? Stop. <laughs> well, at least this one's already here. You know, it's not like um, not like I have to slow it down or anything. I hope. So, how could this one spook me? Obviously, it's all on the rail again. Something... I don't know, like... The Octotron had that kind of... I don't even know what it was, that demon thing. That sort of... looked at me. 
I assume this might be the same. Jesus, that noise scared me. I'm, a, I'm, I'm gonna guess it's gonna be the spooky demon what with it. What do you want? What? We need to talk about Caleb. Hello? What do you mean? What have you done to him? Who? I. That's insulting. Who am I talking you to? You and your boy are everything that this place doesn't want. Uh, the antithesis oh, that's of his what arm. Stand for. Shit, I didn't realize that. The poor child. He tried so hard to do what he was taught. He even left you a trail of breadcrumbs. But the park is just so hungry. Tell me where my son is. The witch has him now. Has both of you. No happy ending here, I'm afraid. Just... Just leave me alone. Fool. You always were. Excuse me, can you remove your arm, please? Thank you. Well. That was... Do again, spooks. A hospital, hospital ward or something. Is this me giving birth? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Take a sip of Pepsi, quick. Okay. No, not okay. What was that? What did it say? I missed it. It's too quick. I'm not concentrating. Ah, stop, please. This is a bad choice. I want to get off the ride, please. Can I get off? Can I get off this ride, please? Oh, I don't like... No, oh, stop it. Stop, please. <laughs> this ride sucks. Oh, my money back. Oh, no. It's not going to now. Oh. Did I just run over a little boy? Did I kill Callum? Did I run him over? Kinda seems like it. I called it, kind of. God damn. Can I get off already, please? Thank you. Wow. What is going on? What was that? Who, who was that? And what was that? Honestly. There's a light above the room though, so maybe I can go in there. I don't want to go in there, obviously. Who was that? Didn't she say something like, what are you doing here? Like, she knows who that was. I assume that it was probably, like, Don. Maybe. Obviously not the real Don, but... Oh, I don't freaking know. Just let me out of here. No, this doesn't look good. Oh, I found a flashlight, finally. I'm sure nothing spooky will happen when I freaking pick it up. Check surroundings, rule number one. Even though it's just going to spawn something in. Okay, do it. The witch awaits. Onto the witch, I guess. That's it, right? That's House of Horrors. That's the last one. Isn't this Sideshow Alley as well? I guess maybe I have to go into it. On his arms. Go through Sideshow Alley to get Someone to. Has been hurting him. I've asked him. Demanded, really, to know where he got the marks. But he doesn't want to answer me. Something has scared him into silence. He doesn't dare talk. He's been changing, too. Something sinister lurks in the darkness behind his eyes. I catch him staring at me at odd moments. In the night, he tosses and turns and cries out words that I cannot understand. When I try to soothe him, he snaps and bites at my fingers. I think he wants to talk to me. I think he wants to tell me. But they are watching him every minute of every day. They are whispering to him in his sleep, changing him. They are taking my baby away from me. I can save him. And there will be pain. But I love him and in the end, he will understand why. Hmm. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me, you've locked me in here, it would appear. Um, yeah, there's obviously some kind of abuse going on. Whether it, like, her ex-husband was abusive, perhaps. Maybe that's how he died. Maybe she killed him. I don't know. Everyone seems a little bit psycho, if I'm honest. What? Newspaper. Read newspaper. Oh, it's just going to throw something up though, isn't it? Can I get like an angle so I don't have to see that way? The whole town was shocked by that one. Never found out who did it. 
All these noises. Cotton candy corpse leaves sour taste in park goers' mouths. Yesterday evening, visitors to Atlantic Island Park were shocked and horrified by the discovery of a dis dismembered corpse behind a cotton candy stand. Can't wait to find that. According to local authorities, the corpse has yet to be identified. However, they have confirmed that the remains appear to be those of a child. The corpse was discovered by a group of teenagers from In Innsmouth Academy who noticed a pair of ravens tugging at something, just out of sight behind the shack. <laughs> God. Not looking forward to seeing that. Nathaniel Winter, the owner of Atlantic Island Park, has released the following statement. It is a true tragedy who, when some... Oh my God. It is a true tragedy when something like this occurs, especially in a place that was de designed to bring forth happiness and joy. The staff at Atlantic Island Park offer their condolences to the family and friends of the victim and will cooperate... 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 <laughs> Jesus, fully, with authorities to help bring this case to rest. The Solomon Chronicle will provide daily updates on the story going forward. Okay. Excuse me. Is there someone behind me? Like, it just sounds like someone's behind me all the time. I don't like this. This is all far too enclosed. What is this? I'm not a fan. I'm sorry, I'm sorry I'm not talking. What the fuck is that noise? Cotton candy? No, I don't want to do it. Okay, well... I guess we're gonna have to. Oh, good. Appears to be a body. Still there. Is it gonna move? Do I have to go up to it? I don't really want to. I'm gonna have some more coke. Okay. Please. Did this to him. I don't know. <laughs> oh! yeah. Was that Chip? I know his name's not Chip, but I'm calling him Chip. Because I freaking hate Chip. I'm just glad I managed to stop in time. I didn't get to see his whole face. I'm not. I'm sorry, I know I said at the beginning of this Let's Play I'm going to explore stuff. Um. They're trying to cover more story, but fuck that, I'm getting out of here. <coughs> I said, <laughs> I'm getting out of here. Why can't I go this way? This has got to be the exit, right? Stop auto-saving, because I can't get out. Why have I got to go back around? Why? Do I have to go in the middle? Is that what it's... Oh, freaking noises, man. Right, run around, and then it's like... I'm in charge, you know? I'm running around. I'll find what I want to find. Can I go out this way, please? Nope. Good. I guess... Th well, the only place I'm not explored is this centre place, so... And doesn't it just look very inviting? What is this? Take pills. You know what? Doesn't seem the best idea in this place, but let's do it. The, these are mine. These are apparently my pills. Oh. Don tattoo on the wrist, I saw it. Yeah, take some pills, why not? Oh good. Oh good. Excellent. I just wanted to get out I was gonna sign off when I got out of this place. Out of that sideshow thing. Fear the boogeyman. Stop picking your nose then. Don't believe anything they tell you. Yeah, you get wrecked. Okay. Hello. No. No. I want to go this way. Get out of here, chip. Stupid chip. Stupid chip face. Okay, I'm going to do him. Ready? I can't sprint, damn it! 
What if I go around this way? Damn it! Look, dude, I just want to get out of here. I think that's the exit. Is that the way I came from? Maybe it is the way I came from. Still, I just want to go past you. Fine! Do it. Hmm. Teddy bears. I'm going to go around the teddy bears. <laughs> I don't want to disturb that stack. Someone put all that time to put them together. Callum, um, the exit's this. Oh, why would you do this, Callum? Oh, I can sprint now. Well, oh, I can sprint for about two seconds. Good. Callum, why are you leaving round circles? What is this? So I do have to go this way. Oh, dude, wherever you've gone, I was going the right way after all, and you just bloody nope. Are those cut wrists on my? Cut marks on my wrist? What is going on? This lady's messed up. Uh, well then. <laughs> can I like, just... Can I just be outside the House of Horrors so that I can end it off? What a strange trip it's been. It has been a very strange trip. You're not wrong there. You are not wrong. Is this the exit now? Am I outside of this sideshow? Park is a collage of contradictions all of its own. Millions of people die every year in car crashes, and the park has little cars designed specifically to simulate that action. Here, the children scream with joy. In the sideshow alley, you can walk away with 15 cents worth of mass produced Chinese teddy bears while a grinning carny pockets your hard earned five dollars. What secrets lie beneath the sullen waters of the lake? The tears of jilted lovers, the soiled condoms of illicit affairs, the clotted blood of the lonely suicide. And the face of the witch looms over it all. I always despised her toothy grin and warty nose. I hate that sparkle in her weathered, watchful eyes. I think Callum is waiting for me. Inside. I love how quickly she gets over these freaking things. Like, what just happened? You had, like, the maddest trip ever. Went to some, like, asylum or something. Then some weird dude was like, turn around. And then there was, like, a stack of teddy bears lined up. And then you had, like, cut marks on your wrists. And then you wake up, and then you're like, oh, I'll just do a little speech to myself. I'm like, no! No, freak out! What's going on? Anyway, I'm going to end off here. In the next episode, we're going to finish this. I'm coming for you. I told you I'll be back for you. Next episode, it all ends. Going to be the final episode, I think. And I will see you guys then. I hope you've enjoyed this one. Take care. Bye-bye.